What up, everybody? It's your boy DJ SJ614. Julissa. And Skittles. And these are the ladies who bronche. Okay? <laughs> it's not a photo, you guys can move. <laughs> like, I'm just ready. Uh, <laughs> 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 All right, we can do this. We're doing this under extreme conditions. I'm just hungry. I'm hungry too. I want like a burger. All right. What up, everybody? It's your boy DJ SJ. Wait, no, no, wait, hold on. Uh. What up, everybody? It's your boy DJ SJ614, and I'm here with Julissa and Skittles. And these are the <laughs> ladies who put it on shit. And we're gonna come into it. Let's come into it. Here. All right, ready? It's just like getting so fucking long. <laughs> oh my god. That's the intro to this video here. What up, everybody? It's your boy DJ SJ614 from the New York Dose. And these are the, the ladies who bronche. All right, guys. So, what is that? Explain to me what is ladies who bronche. So, ladies who bronche is basically um, there's this idea of ladies who lunch, which are like, you know, usually like rich bougie ladies who sit around and have lunch much like what we see in like real housewives so those sort of settings mm -hmm. um, but we're taking it out of the context and really making it about you know ladies from anywhere like skittles and i are from the south of bronx and we're both latinx um and we you know we, we have a particular definition of lady um and ladies who would go out and you know get cute and put their heels on to go to sit to brunch um mm -hmm. there's been this brunch explosion in the last few years and there is that little sect of latinx women where mm -hmm. we're from who do brunch consistently and they sort of have that that's like their moments to talk about the world and their personal lives and Some all that group really yeah, amongst every, each other absolutely it's kind of like it's kind of like sunday night dinner Absolutely, yes, but during yes. the afternoon and I'm feeling cute and I'll get drunk early and be ready for work in the morning. Like, exactly. it's, a, it's a different generation and I think that there's an audience of first generation Latinos who really identify with American culture and things like boozy brunches, mm -hmm. but still very much have a lot of their culture attached to them. So the idea is like, well, let's sit down. Like, let's have these mimosas. Let's have these conversations mm -hmm. with folks from our communities, not from our communities even, about things that matter to us. And so that's ladies who brunches. That's what we do. We banter. We're ladies ladies who banter, we're ladies who bochinchamos, right? And we're ladies who bonche. So. I love it, I love it. And, and, and you touched on it a little bit, but how exactly did you arrive at that name? Well, I love the Elaine Stritch version of the song Ladies Who Lunch, um, and then the song is basically getting drunk and saying fuck you to the high society standards. Mm. Um, and I find that oftentimes I feel like I'm in a moment of not wanting to settle into one version of myself and saying like fuck you to that sort of category and saying we're all like the people who are not conforming are the rebels are the voices that are interesting and so it's sort of that mentality okay yeah. excellent um how did you know that you guys were going to be each other's co-hosts on this uh platform well I feel like I knew immediately when I wanted to do a podcast and when I wanted to capture, like I said, that first generation Latina, you know, voice, I knew that Skittles and I had a great dynamic and how we approached that from two different perspectives. Um, and I think that we complement each other. Like, so we're one person super passionate and the other one's like, eh, then we like fill in for those spots. Um, but we're coming from the same sort of voice, but different sex of that voice. Mm -hmm. So I think I always knew if I needed a co-host, it would, it would just be Skittles. Like, there's no one else who, who would sort of compliment me in that way. And Skittles is graciously down, as he usually is. And 
here we are. And, and how does that go for you? I always knew that she wanted to have a podcast and she had spoken about it a lot um, in the past about having a podcast and then I was kind of like always around to see it develop into oh and I kind of wanted to be like about brunch oh and I kind of wanted to be about this and then so as we were seeing it form before us with her ideas um, it kind of just ended up being like I want our friendship to kind of be magnified and just right. let's record what we naturally do together when we go out to brunch and let's right. bring in the world and invite mm -hmm. them in on it. And so it was just kind of like natural yeah. to fall into. I love it. Mm -hmm. um, what is each of you guys' main hopes for Lady Two Culture? I think my hope is that we reach an audience of folks who are like not the expected audience. Like, I don't want it to just be like girls who identify from like the South Bronx or Latina. I want it to be like, you know, Upper West Side girls, Upper East Side women who like can maybe identify with some of the themes about sex that we talk about. Or, mm -hmm. you know, just someone who's like on the islands back home that we represent that, you know, like women whose voices are constantly trying to be overshadowed by my cheese wall, like coming out. Mm -hmm. Um, LGBTQ uh, plus voices that are like sort of drowned out in those communities that we as first generation have sort of set ourselves in the soil and like can pioneer certain things that just on a global level from where we're from we have the same opinion, the same voice and the same desire to move forward as a society as a Latinx and, and but I want our audience to be more than that I want them to be people who also can find the universality in what we talk about um, but that we actually finally have a voice that comes from us and not us trying to integrate ourselves into other folks' voices. Mm -hmm. And hopefully eventually restaurants, like if you can sponsor us and we have a large enough reach and we're shouting out your brunch spot the whole episode, like that's really my goal is that we would travel and like travel not just with throughout New York City, but like throughout the states, throughout countries and having these brunch conversations out of context, in context, mm. and really trying to connect all those voices on the Yeah. Don't, don't. What about you? Um, oh my God. I think I just wanted to be successful and I wanted to, um, you know, I wanted to be able to flourish and reach all her goals. I, I feel like I'm like a cheerleader in, in the in the corner, but like it's really like I just want that success for it. Awesome. For it, so. And where can they find you guys? So right now we are SoundCloud, Ladies Who Bronche. We are on iTunes, iTunes. as Ladies Who Bronche. You Facebook. Facebook, <laughs> at Ladies Who Bronche. Instagram, at Ladies Who Bronche. Um, and then for Twitter, we are um, <laughs> Ladies, Ladies Bronche. bronche. <laughs> Because it was, be long, it was too long. It was too long. Ladies fuck who Twitter. don't shit. But really, we are ladies who, right? So yes. we're a group of, you know, people who identify as ladies. Whatever that means to you doesn't necessarily have to be women, right? Mm -hmm. Just folks who dibble and dabble in a number of things. So look out for us definitely beyond podcasts. Skittle Music TV. Check out Skittle. Yes. Skittle Music TV. Uh, me at Middle Voice Theater and other endeavors as a playwright, you know. And yeah, we are the ladies. Who the shit Spanish girl say How me thinking they gon' let the Spanish girl away Uh, yeah, and I'm just too pretty Straight up out the womb, up in New York City Long hair, blue eyes, chains, one cities Paved the way for all these washed up biddies Uh, and I'm not the one Gonna have you running back when I am done Fussing on these petty bitches, white ivory son That's it, girl, I won, you're just the re-one BX like big pun, and I ain't even back on Uh, better lane